All right, guys, straight up and down, these are the types of police chases that I like to see. This is a simple situation of I've got a faster car with the big engine, but this car has got a better driver in it. Who's going to win? Stolen Scat Pack Challenger completely does the bat unit in Clayton County dirty, right? That's the burglary, auto theft, and truancy unit dirty. Completely cooks them. Cooks them so bad that the Cobra unit has to intercept. That's right, the Cobra unit. Cobra unit's got one officer, one V6 Durango, chasing a stolen scat pack that's moving like a bat out of hell. Who do you think's going to win that in most scenarios, in most cases? Well, I guarantee you, whoever you think didn't actually win it this time. It's a shocker. And I'm guaranteeing you, you're going to be shocked at the end. You got to wait and watch the entire video because it's a crazy one. Let's go ahead and get into it. What's up, guys? It's your boy, Knockout360, here with another video, man. So you can tell I'm at a house that makes it the house vlog. You know what's going down and around. Let's get into it. I've got car content, car shows, car reviews, car meets. Anything and everything car related happens on this channel. So if you're into that, make sure that you stick around because you're in the right place. For everyone else, hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell so that you know what's coming out and when it's coming out. See, let me tell you something. When I go to Alpharetta, Georgia to get my car worked on, I'm a law-abiding citizen. You know what I'm saying? Hands at 10 and 2. Window rolled down about a quarter of the way so I can let a little light in because I got dark tint. Speaker system at about a 12, right? Even my sunroof is open. I don't want to look inconspicuous at all. Yeah, I don't want to look inconspicuous. Where is it conspicuous? I don't want to look conspicuous. I want to be inconspicuous. That's what it is. I just want to get in and get out because y'all got too many damn units down there in uh, Georgia to be uh, running from. In Charlotte, all we got is Mecklenburg Police and Highway Patrol. Shout out to my man, County Boys, dropping absolutely heat. This is an exclusive. You can only see it here first. Let's get into it. County Boys. All right. So we got the Bat Unit, Burglary, Auto Theft, and Truancy Unit. Scat Pack Challenger. Here it is. This challenge is already taking off on him. Look at the challenger. Look at him. Look at him. Let's go. It'll be light traffic. Speed's going to be 72 miles per hour. Straight up cooking him. Where's the challenger at? Where's it at? That boy, speed's 80 miles per hour. No traffic. Coming up all 314. Serious question. Where's the uh, Scat Pack Challenger at? Do, do you see it? Because I don't. That one coming up on 314. He's 101. 101 on a back road. In a slim body scat. Let's go. Where'd the challenger go? The scat pack cooked his ass a long time ago. Hey, which way that car go? <laughs> which way that car go? That way? That way? Which way that car go? That one be about vehicles going northbound 314. Cooked. Bat unit cooked. Turned his lights off and everything. Let's go to the Cobra unit. Look at Cobra chilling, chilling. Look at the Cobra unit. Cobra unit chilling. We got a scat pack. Now it's a chase, baby. Look 
Look at that. Oh, am I getting on highway? Nope, just choking. I'm just fucking with you. We got ourselves a chase now, baby. Look at him. Got him shaking. Look at that scab moving. Yeah, I'm by myself. I'm by myself. Cobra yeah, unit. By himself. No right, backup. Down Herschel Road. Seats are about 40 right now. Pulling into a parking lot. It's going to be going there. This scab pack is pulling out all the stops. He in a parking lot. He doing U turns. He going crazy. Coming out on the said it's a scat pack so I'm losing them a little bit losing them a little bit where the fuck is he <laughs> where's the scat at where's the scat 105 That's him right there. Most of that right. Oh, that's him right there. See, this is good driving by the cop. He knows where he's going. Instead of making that right, he stays straight. Because he knows where that scat's going to end up at. And that's the scat over there. This is like a movie. Look at him. See what I'm saying? That's good driving right there. I, I, listen, I, I'm, I might have to stop it a couple times. This is good driving by this cop. Good tactical driving, evasive driving, whatever they call it in the academy. This is good driving by the cop. Shout out to uh, Cobra Unit. You don't have to have a fast car. You just got to know how to drive your shit. Also let APD know This is a Durango, by the way. 6,000 pound Durango. I just want you to keep that in mind. Driving a little more careful. Look at him, he on his ass now. Left on Willingham and then back northbound on Main Street. You can tell this cop got a lot of bullshit in his uh, Durango. Every time he make a turn, all you hear is shit falling over all over the place. He probably got lunch boxes and, and and cell phones and iPads and all kinds of shit in there all over the place. Is it raining too? Going towards Atlanta. See, he's trying to get back up, but nobody's coming to his rescue. Yeah, I'm coming towards you on the street. 
V6 Durango, baby. I'm about to pit him. He couldn't pit him because of the pedestrians. See, this is like a movie. All right, now that scat is gone. Now that scat is gone. Goodbye. He's trying to get spikes up ahead. One thing you'll notice about this chase is literally the whole chase, this particular officer is calling for some sort of backup. He's calling for Fulton County police to uh, meet him ahead and pick up the chase. He's asking for spikes. He don't get none of that shit. It's just him in a V6 Durango. It might be an RT. I don't know. Whoa, what's up? What's up? Oh, that shit is sparking. Look at that front right tire. Yeah. Alright, he stopped, he stopped. He stopped. Alright, he stopped, he stopped. He stopped. Now it's a foot chase. Now it's a foot chase. Uh, blue jeans, or I'm sorry, black pants with a white stripe and a black jacket or something right now. Hey, stop, I'm gonna let my dog bite you. He said, I'm gonna let my dog bite you. Go behind the supermarket at Oakland Lane. Still south bound, bitch. See, this is scary as a police officer, as a cop. Get on the ground, you. Get on the ground. God, I don't think I've ever seen that in a police chase, man. Heard a grown man screaming after getting tased. Okay. 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 By myself. He wanted to make sure that they knew I'm by myself. I haven't gotten any help. None of the help that I've been asking for this whole chase isn't here. It's just me by myself. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Both of them. You ain't mm -hmm. up! Mm -hmm. Not yet. Are you okay? No, sir. Huh? I might have to blur out the taser part because of YouTube, but I mean. You got so hot, sir. Mm. 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 Give me up. 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 Talking about some get me up? Who are you talking to? Clear, 22.9. Your body camera not on? Yeah, yeah, don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I said you free. He asked if his body camera was on. The dude was like, yeah, it's on. I don't give a fuck. I don't have nothing. Shout out to Cobra Unit, man. Those dudes are crazy. I'm behind the business owner. I don't got nothing. All right, I got to check in. Relax, I help you up, please. I will. You're good now, okay? You good? I lost my car. It's racing. It's mine. Roll over. He said my heart racing. I will, I will. Hold on. Yes, sir. Please just go one eight one out there. Was that the driver? That's the driver. Nobody else, Sandy. He said my heart racing. You can't drive, bro. What did he say? He got said caught by a Durango, dog. Can you help me out, please? Let me help you out. He said you can't drive. You got caught by a Durango. Oh. Give me him pull. Pull. Get up. You ran this far. You can walk. Get up. He said you ran this far. You can walk. I'm right here, sir. I bet you are. I bet you are. You got my phone? Yeah. Oh, chill. Oh, chill. See, everything's peaceful. They just gonna walk back to the squad car, throw them in the paddy wagon, take them on down to the station. See what I'm saying?
Feet. How do you do that? I'm tired, son. You said you're fast on your feet. Doctor, no, really. You didn't get over it? You didn't get it up, dude. Huh? Wait a minute, let me get it up. I'm tired, too, huh? My legs, son. What's wrong with your legs? Yeah, I'm really weak. You just a fan of course and weak. Step on, step on. You know the traffic. Step on. No, leave it. I got to get pictures from here. Hold on. I got you. 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 I Hold on, I'm gonna shut your door and shut mine. I'm gonna have you sit down and start taking pictures. Look at the scat, man. Damn. You couldn't drive the scat, man. That's definitely a scat. You didn't know how to damn drive it. Hold on, I'm gonna shut your door and shut mine. I'm gonna have you sit down and start taking pictures. Ought to be ashamed. Nah, that's a V6. I think that's a V6. Uh, we're right in front of station 14, the Lee Street station for fire. Alright. Mm -hmm. Bro, shout out. Let me first and foremost, man, before I even go into my uh, uh, my dissertation on this video, man, shout out to Cobra Unit. Shout out to this officer, man. This is one of those videos where you simply just got to give it up to the police. I mean, this was good police work. I mean, sheriff's department, they don't call themselves police, my apologies. Cobra unit, sheriff's deputy work right here. From the driving to the chase to the actual physical uh, foot chase to the uh, taking down of the assailant or the, the criminal, deploying the taser. I mean, you got to give it up to to officers. You know, I'm just going to use the word police as kind of a blanket, you know, term for uh, law enforcement, or law enforcement, I'll just say law enforcement, you got to give it up for them. Because every single police chase that I've ever seen, not only do they have to keep up with the the assailant, the criminal, the, the you know, the person running from the police, whatever you want to call them, not only do they have to keep up with them, but they have to verbally relay location, speed, traffic conditions, all that stuff. Like, think about it. Imagine you've ever been in a police chase, not saying that I have, you know, I mean, you know, I don't, do that stuff in my cars. I've never done that in my scat pack, my Hellcat, not for sure, but I've never ran from the police. You know what I mean? But imagine you running from the police. The last thing you're thinking about is, oh, the traffic is heavy. I got to make it right on North Tryon. Then I got to get on 77. Then hopefully I can make it to 485 and then hit the, you know, 77 or 85 going to Gastonia. Nobody's thinking that. At the end of the day, everything is instinctual at that point. Like you're, you're just running off of instinct. But as an officer, as law enforcement, you've got to stay in the race, stay in the chase. You've got to relay verbal commands back to a uh, command center or whatever the hell they call it, base, station, whatever. You've got to relay all of that. And then after it turns into a foot chase, you've got to catch them, deploy your taser or your firearm, whatever the case calls for. And then, you know, arrest them. Shout out to this officer, man, because not only did he do all of that, he was professional about it at the end, civil about it. He let them know that he couldn't drive, which he couldn't. You know, you got a scat pack, 6.4 liter, 485 horsepower Hemi, and you don't know how to drive it. There's no way in hell that a, a RT Durango, even if it was a RT, there's no way in hell that a RT Durango should be keeping up with the 6.4 scat, simple and plain. So you don't know how to drive your damn car. He let you know that you didn't know how to drive it, which I'm cool with because he didn't. Deployed the taser. You heard your boy screaming, trying to jump the fence. Even when he went around the back of the, uh, uh, I'm assuming it was a, a grocery store, convenience store, did all of that by himself, which in most cases, in most police chases that I've ever seen, there's always backup. Normally there's two people in the car. There's two officers in the car or there's backup. There's multiple cars. In this situation, it was just him. And my hat goes off to him, man. Like this is one of those chases where it's like, you got to show love to the Cobra unit. So it's the Cobra unit, it's the Black Hawk unit, it's the Bat unit. It's a whole bunch of crazy motherfuckers down in Georgia that I don't want no part of. Which is why when I go to Alpharetta, I already told you in the beginning. Window rolled down, 10 and 2, 
Got my speaker right about a 12, sunroof open. I want everything to look legal, legal schmiegel. You know what I mean? I don't want no problems in Georgia. When I get back to North Carolina, that's a different story. But I don't want no problems in Georgia. But uh, shout out to this officer. Shout out to the uh, the bat unit that got uh, cooked. Uh, you hear your boy? He was like, which way did that car go? Would it, would it go that way, that way? But uh, nah, man. Shout out to all the units down there. They did the thing. They um, you know stopped the chase. Nobody was injured. No damage to any property or anything like that. They did the job. Hopefully, whoever scat pack that was that was stolen gets his damn scat pack back. Uh, I, I know I would personally be wanting my scat back immediately. You know what I'm saying? Um, and that's it, man. Shout out to uh, County Boys, man. This is an exclusive. Hasn't even hit the web yet, man. So like, subscribe, comment, tell me what you think. And once again, shout out to the Cobra unit, man. That that was some good. Like that's the type of cop work where it's like you you got to tilt your hat to them. I mean, from the beginning to the end, everything that this cop did, as far as I'm concerned, mind you, I'm not law enforcement, but everything that he did was by the book, one-on-one, -on -one, good work. So shout out to Cobra Unit, shout out to uh, everybody except the person that stole that Scat Pack Challenger and didn't know how to drive it. As always, it's been your boy Knockout360, see you in the next one, peace.